Hey guys, spend a cozy night in with me as I do my nighttime routine. I actually filmed this the weekend of Christmas, so that's why you guys will see some Christmas lights, Christmas music in this video. I didn't want to waste this footage and I wanted to share it, so if you want to see, it's kind of like a nighttime routine with just a cozy night in. So be sure to keep on watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to subscribe. And yeah, we're going to get started. So right here you can just see I was kind of just cleaning up. I think I was editing and doing a bunch of content stuff today. So I just wanted to kind of, you know, reset, put everything away. I try not to work on the couch, but I end up working on the couch a lot. So at the end of the night, I like to just put everything away before I go in and do my routine. Something that is always a part of my nighttime routine, I almost said skincare, but my nighttime routine is kind of pre-setting my bedroom, if that makes sense. So once it's dark, I like to go in, close the blinds, pull the curtains. I have a mini Christmas tree, so I went ahead and turned that on, turn on my air purifier, because it's off during the day, unless I'm home, because since we use it throughout the night, I kind of just give it a little rest. Um, not every night, but if I'm home and I have enough time, I'll go ahead and light a candle, turn out the bedside lamps. You guys see the LED lights around my bed. Sometimes I will go ahead and just remove the pillows if this is right before I get ready for bed. But on this night, I still had a few hours before bed. So I just went ahead, light a candle, turn on the, all the lights and just kind of let the room feel cozy. Next, I'm just gonna move into the bathroom, and something I've been doing a lot of lately is just kind of do like a couple minutes of clean up, pick up, just kind of putting everything where it needs to go. Um, during the holiday season, there was a lot of stuff going on, a lot of packages, a lot of things. So I just kind of wanted to put away some things. I think I had some laundry on this day. So I just wanted to put things back where they belong before I get to relaxing. So this is just me tidying up a little bit before I get ready to take my shower. Most nights, unless I'm rushing, I like to set the mood to get ready for my shower. So I'm going to start with lighting a candle. I have been rotating all my candles. I'm hanging on to these forever mood candles. They're literally at the bottom of the tin, but I'm trying to enjoy all of it. So I'm just going to light We Not Lincoln. And um, while I was on the couch, my husband was like, uh, can you make me some chicken soup? And I was like, fine. I guess <laughs> so I went ahead and placed an Instacart order I wanted to make like the more American chicken noodle soup and I did add a little bit of my Jamaican seasoning in there but it was mostly like an American chicken soup so placed my order and I decided to put on some Christmas music because I felt like I wasn't really playing a lot of Christmas music this season I just wanted to enjoy the vibes, so that's what we did. Also, I live for a cozy pajama set during this time of year. It's my favorite thing to do, so I went ahead and picked out a cute pajamas. It's the one I got from Amazon, and I'm going to put my towel as well as my pajamas inside the towel warmer. You guys know how I feel about this towel warmer, okay? I don't have to say anything. Get 
this was kind of a everything shower day so i was washing my hair i was doing my full routine you guys see the led lights i live for my shower routines like it's a whole self-care thing okay i'm using my exfoliating gloves i'm using the necessary the body wash with the eucalyptus so relaxing like i could not say enough about this body wash i absolutely love it it's my favorite after a long day now that i'm out of the shower my towel is nice and hot and i just enjoy that little moment we're gonna go ahead and moisturize our skin i'm trying this vaseline coco radiant body lotion for the first time i've been seeing a lot of influencers use it recently i've been looking for the body butter but i couldn't find it so i went ahead and just picked up the body lotion i will say it took a little rubbing in to get absorbed into my skin but i think my skin looked really good the next day i wasn't ashy so i think this is a nice cream if you're looking for a new lotion to try <laughs> so my instacart order got delivered so it's time to get these ingredients to make my chicken noodle soup I told you guys i'm making the american chicken noodle soup uh, my husband actually doesn't like my chicken food soup so i figured you know what let me make his kind of chicken soup so i got a bunch of um chicken broth and beef broth because we also use this for our dog food so i needed some for him as well but i'll be using the chicken broth for the soup and i think i end up using two of these and then i just got um chicken breast with the bone in like the whole chicken breast um i didn't really think this through that i needed to like cook the chicken breast first but you'll see that later on but i grab everything else that i might need some potatoes some celery i had onions um what else did i grab uh, the extra noodles some garlic because i was out um i think i picked up a turnip as well and i picked up some carrots and parsley was on the recipe so i was like you know what let me pick that up as well so i'm starting by prepping everything the celery um half an onion i think is what i use or full onion the turnip the carrots this recipe was actually pretty easy to make and it's even easier if you already have cooked chicken or rotisserie chicken that you can use it's actually a pretty easy chicken noodle soup recipe and i'll definitely use it again so 
so I just added a little bit of olive oil all the veggies let them soften a little bit add the chicken broth this is where I realized that this recipe was meant for chicken that's already cooked so I ended up putting the chicken breast separately and let it boil for some time and then once it was like halfway cooked then I took it out and added it to this broth here so add everything and just kind of let it boil and boil I added the potato later on and I don't even remember what other like seasoning I added to this but when it got close to the end then I just added the Jamaican cock noodle soup and some pumpkin into it and that just gave it the Jamaican seasoning it was so good I didn't know I would like it that much <laughs> after like an hour hour and a half i honestly don't remember it was time to just kind of make our bowls and go cuddle up on the couch so this is just me making our bowls uh, like i said this soup was actually so good uh, we end up having some saltine crackers with it as well. I feel like chicken noodle soup or like chili is a perfect like meal for a cozy cold night in. So we end up just finishing watching Home Alone and then we end up um, watching Raising Canaan which is a show that we watch together. So that's how the soup turned out. It was so good. So good. <laughs> Um, so yeah, that is it for my cozy night in um, This was like so perfect So if you want to see more videos like this, let me know I plan on doing like a nighttime routine like my 6 to 9 after my work night So that was it. We just finish up home alone and relax and enjoy the season So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe I will see you guys in the next one. So I hope you have a close night too. I need rest now. Love me one though. You so you so you